a heartbreaking discovery as frigid temperatures hit Kansas City. A homeless man returns to find his friend frozen to death on a night they both struggled to stay warm. 41 Action News reporter Andres Gutierrez has their story. Another frigid night in Kansas City's homeless seek warmth, be it through the heat of a fire, a hot meal, or a warm beverage. The bitter cold brings consequences that are at times deadly. I miss him. James McLaughlin is now dealing with the aftermath. He's holding back his tears as he remembers his friend of more than 20 years, Reggie Glenn, who died of exposure on New Year's Day. He's dancing in the clouds. McLaughlin says the two of them had sought refuge from the elements in a shed in the West Plaza, although the insulation and the piles of blankets they had simply weren't enough to keep his friend warm. McLaughlin made the grim discovery that evening. He had one eye open and one eye closed. I thought he was looking at me. So I kicked his foot. He didn't respond. I looked at him. I picked him up and he was frozen. So I sat him back down. As McLaughlin mourns, he carries on with the help of people like Tammy Eldridge, the owner of a Westport flower shop. He comes in about every day, walks by, waves, says hey. For the last two years, she's made sure that when the temperatures get extreme, McLaughlin has somewhere to turn to. They're all somebody's child, and I think about that every time I see one of them walk by, that there's somebody's child out here on the street that's cold, that's hungry. In Kansas City, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action. News.